Smoother skin takes all kinds of treatments in real life. In Photoshop, it only takes one. So this technique is pretty simple. You use a couple of light blur filters to help with hiding some of the details in the skin without making it look unnatural. The headshot I have here is Cassandra Leach. She's a friend of mine and a professional actress. Check out some of her uh, acting info below this video. All right, so we'll get started. So press Command and Control J to duplicate the layer. And then we're going to go to Filter, Blur, Surface Blur. This is a specialized blur filter for things like skin or buildings or things like that. It's pretty, pretty good. I like it a lot. So we'll move this guy over to under the eye. And you can see the pores that disappear due to this blur. So you want to adjust accordingly. If you get to that point, it's a little bit too much. It's a little bit unrealistic. So we'll keep it at five pixels. And if you change the threshold, you can change the amount of detail you get as well. So I'm going to keep the threshold at six levels. And there we go. That's pretty good. So turn preview off. That's what it looks like before the effect. Turn preview on. It gets rid of a lot of the uh, details, like the pores in her skin, things like that. It makes the skin look smoother. That's okay. Now we're going to open quick mask mode, then grab the paintbrush tool. As you can see, I have zombie presets from my previous uh, series, Make a Movie Poster. I don't want to use zombies. I want a soft brush with a zero hardness mode on normal and make sure that my color is black. And you carefully paint in the details that you do not want to be blurred, such as her eyes. Eyes, eyebrows, hair, and mouth are usually the way to go. And you can do the hair as well, but I'm just going to use this for an example. I'm not going to do the hair right now. So we turn off quick mask mode. You can see it's selections now. So now that we have our eyebrows, eyes, and mouth selected, we simply click Add Layer Mask, and it only masks out the mouth and the eyes, so it keeps its detail while the rest of the skin is smooth. So turn the effect off, more detail, turn the effect on, and it makes her skin smoother while it keeps her eyes and mouth nice and detailed. And there you go, it's a pretty simple effect. All right, guys, I hope you learned something from this particular tutorial. If you have any questions or requests about touch-ups or enhancements, please send me an email to request at mahalo.com, and please be sure to also rate, comment, and subscribe below.